So in this example, again, another thing that I want to look at is I can rewrite this as 1 over 2 to the x um, to the 2 over 3, which is the same thing as x to the negative 2 thirds over 2. And you could also see that I could actually even take out my fraction here, x to the negative 2 thirds. Okay, so you guys can see this is actually a constant being multiplied by a function. So if I'm going to evaluate dy over dx, um, you guys can see that now I'm going to take a look at this. I can rewrite this as 1 half, change the derivative over dx of x to the negative 2 thirds. I take my power, bring it down in front, and then subtract. So that's going to give me 1 half times negative 2 thirds. And then I have to times x to the negative 2 thirds minus 1. Negative 2 thirds minus 1 is the same thing as negative 2 thirds minus 3 over 3, which equals negative 5 thirds. Multiply this out. So therefore, it's going to be negative 2 over um, 6, which is just a negative uh, 1 third, times x to the negative 5 thirds. Since that's negative, I can rewrite that then in the denominator. And I simplify that to 1 third. So my final answer of dy over dx is just going to be uh, 1 over 3x to the 5 thirds. Uh, yes, it is supposed to be negative. Forgot about that. Thank you. I missed that. <laughs>